Hello, you lot. Um, sorry, I've got my mobile because I'm focusing, focusing my camera. Um, right. How about me and you go out there? And we're going to go out there. Do you know why? Well, today is the 15th of October, and there's nothing that particularly special about the 15th of October. But temperatures out there are today here in Germany over 345 degrees Celsius or maybe 20, 22 some 23 then perhaps but it's hot and it's lovely and I've just come back from work and what I thought I'd do is have a nice little bimble around my local area so I'll show you where I live to it to a certain degree and also what autumn looks like here now I know what you're thinking, autumn here probably looks like autumn where you are, but I just thought it would look very picturesque and a nice place to make a video. I'll try and persuade the wife to come with me. I'll try and persuade her to speak on camera, because she does speak English, sort of. Um, she's going to kill me for that comment. Sorry I haven't been around for a while. I've been very ill. You should never tell your viewers that you've been ill, because they don't care. They don't care about your health. They're not going to send you flowers. Oh, I forgot to say, yes, today's video is actually sponsored, sponsored by Round Place. Now, Round Place, for those that want to start a website or start a small business and need a website, one of the best places never to go is Round Place, because I've just made it up. Round, Round Place don't exist as far as I know, because um, I haven't got any sponsors. I'd like to be sponsored. Um, if I could be sponsored by a a brewery, a brewery, any brewery that makes beer, please feel free, contact me via email, uh, contact me via carrier pigeon if you want, or smoke signals. I would definitely wear your t-shirt if you send me beer. Fingers crossed. It's not going to happen, is it? <laughs> Shall we go outside? Oh, final thing, I've got a camera on a stick now, and it's crap at focusing. Let's go. I'm going to go that way, even though I should really go in the rule of thirds because I'm sitting this side. I should really go that 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 way, but that way is the balcony, and then I fall to my fall to my death. Mind you, with this stomach, I probably bounce. Bye. Of course, I'm still here, really, because I've got to press stop on the camera. So, first of all, why vlogging? No, in fact, first of all, why the hat? The hat is to stop when the sun comes, me squinting at the camera and looking stupid. Um, okay, before I start my little, my first ever vlogging series, I want to give you the reasons why, why I want to do it. Even though my good lady wife doesn't want me to do it, my family probably don't want me to do it. Kids are probably looking at this going, oh my God, Dad, what are you doing? Um, there's, a bit of a bit of a bit of there's various reasons why I want to start vlogging. We'll start off with the most important. Uh, I lost my mother in 2010 to cancer after caring for her for the last two years. And I realised uh, later on that I've got the only memories I've got of her are in my head. I've got about one photo. My brother's got all the other photos, which he's kindly sending me some actually soon. Um, and I've got some audio clips of which I recorded when she was ill to try and get some really some evidence for social services to show that she needed care and she needed help. Um, at the time we didn't know she had cancer. She knew she had cancer. Um, and where am I going with this? It's all about I want to have something where my children 
when I'm gone, which is going to be miles away hopefully, unless I trip over with this camera, where they've got something where they can see that that's my dad, that's who he was. Um, very morbid, but that's that's one of the reasons. Let's move on to something a bit more positive. I've also got the highlights blown out. Hang on. Told you it's my first ever go. Without the hat, with the hat. Without the hat, with the hat. Um. Fuck it, without the hat. <laughs> Jesus. Right, hang on, let me just put my hat away in my bag, which is squeaking nicely as I walk. Which way do we want to go? Do we want to walk past the river or do we want to walk along the leafy path? River's probably nicer, river's probably got more people. Let's do the river. Okay, second reason I want to start vlogging is I've been influenced by such YouTubers as Casey from Camera Conspiracies, who's a Canadian, unfortunately. Um, I'm starting to try and train myself to actually accept Americans and Canadians on YouTube, even though they seem to rule it. But he's good. He's funny. Uh, his videos, check him out. He's got two channels. He's got uh, Vegetable Police and Camera Conspiracies. And trust me, once you've watched a few of camera conspiracies, you'll spend your day singing. All I want is the perfect camera. Um, but you will, trust me. It's frustrating. Other inf influences, uh, Casey Neistat, Peter McKinnon, of course. Um, so that's the second reason. Just checking around me, because as I'm new to vlogging, I get extremely nervous being anywhere near human beings. Animals are fine. Human beings, God, in fact there's some cyclists coming. Yeah, so being influenced by others. Now, what I've got to be careful of as he walks through this jungle, just for your benefit, is I don't want to mimic people too much. So as you notice, this video, unlike camera conspiracies, has, my video has zero humor in it. Um, I wish it did. <laughs> what do you think of the lens, by the way? This is the kit lens. I do have a 15mm Leica lens. And no, I didn't copy Camera Conspiracies. I saw it somewhere else first and he just happened to review it. Um, oh my God, I'm going to be seen as copying him directly, even with the gear. I'm shooting with Panasonic G85. However, the difference being, and this is how I'm not copying Casey, is in my country, Germany, um, it's called the G81. Look at this beauty, you're not even watching me because of this lovely river, aren't you? Stunning. So influencers, now influencers, why am I waving my camera around so often? It's because I'm new to it. It's like I've got a camera on a stick, so I'm gonna use it. Influencers, right now, the third reason, there is a third reason, have I said a two, two reasons? Third reasons, the last reason, this is a good one, so listen in. I was on a very popular Facebook linked media information site, sort of tells you everything about up and coming photography, tips and tricks, um, and I made a comment using my username of Photomedian about Greta, whatever her name is, Greta the, the young girl that spoke up about the environment and said how things are going down the pan. I was like, sure, this wind's good. Let me find a bit more shelter. Otherwise, you're not going to hear the most important part of the reason why I'm vlogging. Yeah, so I made a comment about Greta, and it wasn't having a go at her. Uh, I think what she's done is, yeah, well done. You've said what you've said your piece and people have jumped all over it because she was so emotional how she said it. How dare you! Now my comment was something along the lines of because the, because the, because the story was about a photographer who took a, a photo of her using a very old technique. So all I did was made a comment which was supposed to be humorous 
that what's the next thing she's going to be doing driving a car with square wheels you know it's going back old stuff def not necessarily means good you know in my opinion a lady who will re remain nameless a fellow photographer made a comment along the lines of I'm sure your seven subscribers will be pleased to see you slagging off Greta and that got to me to start with what I'd like to do now is thank that that woman because that's inspired me to work on my YouTube channel now my YouTube channel is young it's about four months old and yes I don't have many subscribers but I'm not a thumbs up whore it doesn't bother me I'm doing this for, like I say for my own reasons if you want to come along for the ride and see what my life's all about please do I mean that sincerely I can say thank you to her for actually pushing me to to work on my channel um, for those of you that do have their own channels and do vlog or do produce content it's not easy um, I work for a living as well so I don't have as much time as I'd like to actually full to do this full time and record stuff so anyway positive news um, that's that's some of the reasons why I decided to start vlogging uh, it won't be as often as I'd like I'll try and get on as often as I can somewhere where there's no wind unlike this place epic 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 b roll b roll b roll photo media the youtube channel channel has confusing content content Look at the hair in this wind, it's like I've got some. Now a little bit about myself. So I live in Germany, I'm British at birth. Married a German lady called Susanna. But you only call her Susanna when she's been naughty. I don't mean that in a kinky way. Um, Susie. Susie hates being in front of the lens, so you'll probably never see her, but she does exist. Um, I'm big into my health and fitness, as you can see. And um, hey, there's something I don't have in common with Casey. That's good. At least I can say he's not. I'm not mimicking him with health and fitness. Um, first of all, a slight apology. It's my first ever go with a camera on a stick and I've noticed already that I've started to look at the screen to the right rather than at the lens at you. I'll get the hang of it so bear with me. All I want you to do is stay with me during my journey. Uh, I'm going to start off by showing you around my local area so you get to know who I am, what I do. Well, another cyclist is about to knock my camera out of my hand. Um, and I'm also intending to do a bit of travelling. I enjoy travelling. One of my hobbies is um, Excuse me, let's come through. Sorry, just go past. Mine. Uh, mine, for those that don't know it, is a word they use for everything in Germany. So, in North Germany, sorry. Mine can mean good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Sounds like a film. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. <laughs> okay, I've got rid of the screen now so I can actually pay attention to the actual lens and talk to you. Yeah, hoping to lose a bit of weight as I go. So that's going to involve walking, it's going to involve travelling, it's going to involve healthier eating, and it's going to avoid avoiding snacks. <laughs> the problem I have in Germany is bread rolls. Bread rolls here are delicious. And here comes a jogger. Right, what else? So that's just a little bit about what the vlogging series is going to be about. Travel interesting places, saying things twice, which I'm doing now, and um, trying not to be embarrassed when joggers and tourists come past. 
Okay, things I've learned already with vlogging, just for some tips for you guys. You see a lot of vloggers wearing sunglasses. Now the reason they do that is not because they think they're cool. It's to stop them, or to stop you seeing them looking at the screen. Um, I've got a screen to the, with, with this particular camera. I've got a flippy screen to the right, or to my right, um, which tells me if the shot is in what I call rule, rule of thirds. And it's very difficult not to keep glancing at it to check that you're in focus, to check that you're in the right place. So they wear sunglasses so the viewers don't see that. As you can clearly see it's not the weather for sunglasses and especially over here you get frowned at. You even get frowned at over here. A lot of Brits seem to wear track suits and um, sports clothes constantly. Never do that in Germany unless you're doing sport. You will get frowned at or you'll, people will think you're either Russian or English. It's a dead giveaway, especially at airports. Airports, you can clearly see the Brits because <laughs> they're wearing tracksuits. So we're going to head back home. Thank you for joining me on the travels. I'm going to wrap it up there. And I'm going to finish off really by just saying, stay with it. And I am a beginner, I am a learner. And all I ask is for your undivided attention, just to see how my video skills and my vlogging skills improve. I'm looking at the fucking screen again and I'm looking at the fucking screen again so I've just noticed even though I'm supposed so I've just noticed even though I'm supposed to know this camera that I've had e-stabilization turned on as well as normal hand stabilization so I'll have a look see what that looks like now I've just got normal in-camera IBIS whatever it's called IBIS yes uh, in body in body inbuilt inbuilt in in body inbuilt stabilization something like that yeah something moving in the reeds probably a I'd love it to be a deer but it's probably just a, a rat it's not as easy as people think to walk around holding a camera talking to yourself especially when there's people around and if you follow me, I'll follow you. I don't care what they say on YouTube about that being bad etiquette. Uh, if you make vlogs and walk around with your camera, I'm interested to see what you do for a living, for a life. Um, and it's a nice way to make meet and make new friends, hopefully. So from me, here in northern Germany, sun's just about to come out and ruin my exposure. All the best. Bye.